And hello folks, this is your old pal Uncle Al. I'm back. It's April the 2nd. I took a couple days off. I overdid it in uh, what you call it, Easter. My back was thrown out. That's why I have a heating pad over there. Horrible pain. I'm on Percocet again. Nice thing because everybody likes Uncle Al. I do get, uh, what you want to call it, cards and coupons and stuff like that all the time. Because people know know Uncle Al and they trust Uncle Al. So I get uh, flyers for coupons. I get in the mail cards. Say thank you Uncle Al. Uh, go check out Prepping with Sarge. And that's a good point. And we're going to our, again, check out Prepping with Sarge. He did a video. And this is like the VR to Corsair trainers. I know I've seen it and everything. But he's on the therapist side. People normally react to the bloody mess. Now me, no qualms. A lot of people are scared of Uncle Al. And it should be. All right. Have no qualms. All right. Uh, the big problem with most people is... Um, if it's a true SHTF and they look at the body, I told them, either gut them, chop them up pieces, you know, uh, they freak out. All right, they'll have nightmares, they'll have post-traumatic stress disorder. Okay? Um, no. Uh, like I said, this is not part of that. Go check out Prepping with Sarge video, understand it. Talk to a lawyer, talk to a therapist. This is the main problem of using a deadly weapon. A lot of people don't understand that. A lot of people never had the trait to do that. Okay? It is not defending yourself. It is living, just eliminating a life form. Okay? Do not eat the life form unless it's a deer. All right? Uh, big problem is... This is, I have to say it, this is for entertainment only. It's not advice. Talk to a lawyer or a therapist or both. Okay, I have to put that thing because my lawyer is always telling, they don't get your humor, Uncle Al. I don't really care, but on the legal side, I don't want to spend all the time in court suing the hell out of the local government or the state government or the federal government. Good copy. Okay. The title of this is uh, Helping Out or Preparing the Unprepared or the NPC Character Non Non Player NPC Non Character Player or Your Cousin Dumbass or Dumas. Okay. Dumas, you've been warning him for years about getting the basics, you know, what to carry in your pockets, uh, uh, go home bag or get home bag, explaining it's from point A to B. You have to repeat that many times. And sometimes it gets through. Sometimes they had no idea and I'm kind of looking at them. You're going to poke your eye out or you're going to shoot it off. More likely, they're going to shoot off their penis. I can say penis. I can't say the other word. Okay? Or they're going to shoot themselves in the groin area. That's both men and women. I have to be fair. Or whatever gender you believe in. Okay? A lot of people have no idea what the hell they're doing. I'm keeping this short because a lot of people don't have attention space deficit. They don't pay attention, all right? Uncle Alan's still waiting to get his teeth back. I got a new set, but I can't talk with him. All right? Bottoms work fine. Upper is, you know, I don't want to talk and my teeth flies out. Okay, big thing for Dumas. Cousin Dumas, or like Cousin Dave in Ohio, he married into the family. That's Dave Chappelle. And he did a comedy routine on talking about shotguns. 
And I said, do you know why we're getting a shotgun? And he said, to kill people? No. And he was like, why can't I get an assault rifle? Why can't I get a handgun? Uh, there's no such thing as assault rifle. You mean semi-automatic. What the hell is the difference? You know, go through three hours of that. I'm lo looking at her. You married him. Okay? So, like I said to Cousin Dumbass, I mean, Cousin Dave from Ohio, how to set up certain things. And this is one of them. All right? And I said, we go with the shotgun because it's easier. And it took me a while. Can I now get a pump or the one you're using? I said, no, you're going to shoot your eye out. Okay, what I got him was a single shot um, or over and under from Savage, 22 on top, and then 20 gauge on the bottom. And he says, why can't I shoot, shoot 12 gauge? So I let him shoot my 12 gauge, my old 870, that's my duck gun, and I put him on his ass and he was freaking out. And I said, now go shoot the 20 gauge. All right. It's like, he said, that's a big difference. I'm like, yeah, if you were to fall down on your butt on the 20 gauge, you'll get a 410. And I let him shoot that. And, I, and he says, why can't I just use the 410? I'm like, boy. Okay, I keep telling her, you married him. And he's black. All right. Yeah, if you're black and you don't know how to use certain things, it's like, just like a white person. But anyway, not to be racist. It's just incompetence and stupidity. Okay? Big problem here is a lot of people don't know how to really use guns and they don't know what happens afterwards. So that's why I tell them, talk to a lawyer, talk to a therapist before coming seeing Uncle Al. Because Uncle Alan doesn't want to waste time. Okay, we got him a 20 gauge to start off with and 25 rounds. Two of the rounds are bean bags. Five of the rounds are. Alright, five of the rounds are buckshot. Alright, there'll be two uh, triple odd buck and then the rest is number four. So that's two buckshot and three number four. All right, if you understand what I'm talking about, it's not hard. And then we have bird and rabbit loads. All right, that take care of all small game. So if you can do the math, you have seven rounds for defense, and then the rest is for bird and small game. So you don't shoot your eye out or shoot your penis off. All right, and it's in a box. I sometimes include a pouch. Uh, explain the pouch to Dave. It's Molly pouch or uh, Alice pouch. It holds, uh, let's see, I think it's nine to ten shotgun shells. It's fairly easy. Clip it onto your belt. It's not rocket science. All right. Some people, it is rocket science. All right. And he always questioned me, why can't I get a double air shotgun or over and under or why is it a single shot? And I explained to him, you're going to shoot off your penis. I don't know how or why or you're going to shoot your eye out. All right. We're keeping it fairly simple. A lot of people watch too many TV shows and Hollywood movies. They don't understand the real world. And when we go do reality... They're freaked out. All right? They think it's a wonder weapon. That's why I told them, use a shotgun, know how to use it. You practice every day. All right? And a lot of people, how many days do I have to practice? Every other month. With me behind your butt kicking you. All right, folks. I'll catch you later. Remember, grow a garden. Uh, and save America to learn how to stockpile and put away and process. And three, get a bicycle. It don't need feed, doesn't need water. It's mechanical. Because I gave up mostly on self-defense because a lot of you don't understand. It. Description down below explaining what I just talked to you about. Remember, this series is for uh, uh, 
what you call your cousin Dumas. All right, folks, I'll catch you later. God bless and good luck. I'll be seeing you.